Hello everyone, my name is B and welcome back to another video on my Roblox channel. I hope you guys are doing well. Hello everyone. Today guys, we are going to talk about something that I just realised today. So if you haven't seen already, Lance has already tweeted a video out, which basically in the video he says that they're hoping to have the new update out today. Here's a quick clip from that video so that you can see in case you missed it. We've been working really hard on these updates. They've taken a lot longer than we kind of thought they would, but we've it's definitely the biggest update we've ever done. The Halloween update is what we're focusing on right now. We're thinking that no update should ever take this long again because this is probably the biggest rehaul we've ever done and a lot of the systems we're using will be able to be used for future updates and just thank you guys for bearing with us. As you can see in the video, he says that they're hoping to have the update out today and that made me realize something, you guys. Normally, when a realm gets an update and they change things in the game, of course, it's okay because the next time the season comes around, it will go back to how it was before. So we'll be able to experience the summer version of the realms again in the future. However, I realized something. We're going to be having the massive school redo and complete new Royal High update shortly after the Halloween update. So that means we may not see some of these places in this summer style ever again. For the realms that are being changed, and also just for the fun of it, have a look at some of the ones that aren't being changed, I thought we would have a quick look at all of the realms as they are right now so that we can remember them and we can reminisce inside of them right before the new update comes out today, which obviously is going to change them forever. So let's start off in the most recent realm, obviously, the Beach House realm, the realm that we are in right now, is the most recent one that was added to the game. I don't know if it's going to be Halloween themed or have any Halloween decorations. Probably not. But as you guys probably remember, this is the one that I feel like... I feel like when I first started uploading again after taking a huge break because of just everything that I was doing at the time, I feel like this was the first realm that I actually played in. Back when I took a big break from Roblox, this realm was not in the game. So this was very, very new when I came back to playing Royal High. This had just been re-added to the game again. So obviously the beach realm was something that I know loads of people were really excited about. I remember seeing a bunch of videos and loads of people tweeting about it when they were waiting for it to come out. I still feel like this balcony area can be quite empty in some places, but it's really, really cute. This, I feel like, Loads of people were so excited about when it came out, you guys, and it is a really cute realm, so I can understand why, but obviously it's still going to be in the game. Lance did already confirm that they will not be removing the beach realm when they add or change any realms in the future because he said he doesn't like to remove content from the game that has already been added and people have already played with. So don't worry if you enjoy the beach realm and you want it to stay, it is not going anywhere, it will be staying. But I am excited to see whether or not it gets any Halloween changes. I don't think it is going to, but it would be cool if maybe we could put a couple of jack-o'-lanterns in here and just make it a little bit Halloween themed. One of the more exciting updates, our more exciting realms that got added to the game, in my opinion, was obviously Divinia. And obviously when Divinia was removed, they obviously replaced it with Divinia Park. So this is Divinia Park, obviously, which is the really, really beautiful looking gorgeous like park in the middle there's the lakes there's all of the outside areas there's obviously this carrot patch which i'm going to pretend is a pumpkin patch for halloween and then of course we have the beautiful fountain of dreams in case you might win a halo and all of these beautiful paths and these trees and just the docks everything is so cute in this realm you guys and i remember when this realm was being made and i remember the tweets that were being tweeted out of process obviously it is very easter themed still i'm pretty sure it came out for easter right it was an easter update and i'm not a huge like easter fan but i do think this is a really beautiful realm and i do come here in a hope that one day i will win a halo and I keep trying it, but I keep not winning one. So let's just pretend I have one and not look at it. It's fine. I do not think they've had any announcements as to whether they're going to be making Divinia Park Halloween-y for this year. But that's okay because there's still plenty more realms to check out. Let's head to the next one. So the next one that is going to be changing is obviously Battle a la Royale. As you guys know, they have already announced that they are changing this, which is very exciting, you guys. I am so hyped to see this Halloween theme. I've never actually played it before, guys. It's the first time I've actually really been on it but it is really cool and i'm excited to hear that they are working on bringing out an halloween update for it i feel like oh i feel like not very many people play on here so i'm quite excited to hear that there's going to be a halloween update added 
It is a really, really pretty scenery. Like, look at how gorgeous this is. So I'm really excited to hear that they're going to be Halloweening it. This lobby area is all going to be Halloween themed. And of course, then you can go out to battle after seeing your beautiful, spooky Halloween decorations, which I kind of don't fit in with because I'm kind of a cute fall right now. I'm not a spooky fall, but it's fine. It's fine. We'll pretend. Don't look, guys. Just don't look. So next up, guys, we are at Sunset Island. We weren't be going to Enchantix High or Fantasia Hotel because obviously those are the old realms and are unlikely to change and probably will stay exactly how they are right now, probably forever. But guys, Sunset Island, I don't think is changing either, which I feel like that makes sense because Sunset Island is obviously a very hot, summery kind of theme. It's a very hot kind of vibe and I can understand why they wouldn't want to change this to be Halloween-y. Although people in hot countries do still obviously celebrate Halloween and do still put decorations up so maybe it would be cool but I don't know where they would really put Halloween decorations in here and I'm not sure have they ever Halloweenified Sunset Island before I'm not sure because I haven't played like, consistently enough in Royal High I am excited to finally be playing it regularly and understanding the change to the game but I don't think they're Halloweening Sunset Island but Nonetheless, it is one of the cutest islands, I think, in the whole of Royal High, and I love coming here for little bits of B-roll, the little bits of footage that we use in our videos where you're just, like, looking at yourself and stuff like that. I think this is one of the prettiest places to do that in. So I'm really, really excited that they're not removing the any realms and not getting rid of Sunset Island because I think Sunset Island is one of the best. I do remember when I first saw Sunset Island coming out, I thought this was going to be a roller coaster that goes across here, but of course, it is just a ginormous swing set attached to all of the things that you need on the stage. All right, you guys, let's go ahead and head to the last realm. So guys, I'm sure you remember that Earth has had a fair few changes over the last couple of years since it came out. Obviously, back when I first played Earth, the cafe over here was open and we could go in and get fraps and other drinks. Obviously, other parts of the game were here too that they're not in now. And obviously, this over here was not apartments. This used to be, well, I remember it because I was playing Christmas. There was a Christmas hut here you could go into. And during Halloween, there was a big um, pumpkin patch thing here as well that you could all go inside of. And there was loads of trick-or-treating things. My favorite season is fall. I'm so excited for Earth to be Folly again. Obviously, the um, fountain used to be over here and stuff as well, and there wasn't a Divinia Park, so things have changed a lot since then, you guys. But in honesty, I actually kind of miss the old Earth. I really loved the old Earth the way it was before. I loved how gorgeous it was, and I know that it's completely different now, and I know that, obviously, you have to, obviously, you have to deal with change. Obviously, things change all the time, and I still don't really understand what this is. Obviously, things have to change, and you can't always have them the same, but I do kind of miss the old Earth. I really liked the old Earth, but of course, everything is changing again, and I'm sure it will change in Earth again as well. So, you guys, obviously, on Earth, things are very different now, but they haven't really said whether they are going to actually Halloweenify Earth or not. As far as I'm aware, I don't think they are. I think they're actually leaving Earth mostly alone, which to me, guys, kind of makes me feel like I wonder if Earth is going to stay much longer or if they've got bigger plans for Earth. So I feel like it hasn't really had anything done to it in so long. So I'm not sure if maybe they've just got other plans for Earth or something like that. Maybe it's that they have a big plan for Earth in the future. But right now, I don't really think Earth is all that fun. I don't really come here anymore for anything. Obviously, the only reason why you would really want to come here is probably because of the home stores during the events but right now we haven't really got any going on so there's not really any reason to come here and I do remember them saying that the stores way back when F came out that all of the stores would be active and you'd be able to go inside of them but we still can't so I don't know if maybe they're still planning that for the future or not but I suppose the only spooky part of um, F is probably this this fire around the back um, but yeah it's, it's, it's a shame but also it's fun. So I guess we'll find out more, guys, once the update comes out. And of course, last but not least, the most important part of Royal High, of course, is the school. So let's head on into the school, guys, and we will talk about it in there. So guys, of course, we already know a ton of things are changing in the school. It's very unlikely that they're going to do a Halloween update inside the school. I'm pretty sure they're not. And the reason why I say that is because obviously the new school is literally about to come out and it will be a whole new school. I don't know if maybe they'll put the spooky castle back on that they've had in the past. As far as I'm aware, or at least what I've read, I don't know if this is going to be spookyfied, mainly because, guys, the school's going. This school is not going to be here 
here much longer and of course we're going to have a brand new school in its place i don't know if they're going to keep this school active like they did with enchantix high so people can still go back and play it i'm really not sure but this castle and this school is of course going soon and a brand new royal high will replace it and you guys i am so excited for that new royal high i don't know if you've kept up with the screenshots and the designs of the new castle but it looks absolutely incredible you guys it looks amazing but like let's get back over here so we can actually see this school is beautiful like, this castle is beautiful but i am so excited that they're going to be replacing it with this new school i'm so hyped for it guys and obviously these beautiful walls i don't even remember them being here guys so i don't even remember when they i don't i'm assuming they've been there the whole time but i don't actually remember them being added so that's crazy but yeah this school is going to be going soon so i'm excited to see the brand new one and i do think that maybe they might put the spooky high school back on just until the new castle comes but i'm really not sure oh how do you get that diamond i'm just curious guys how do you get a diamond when it's sealed in hmm interesting i'm sure there's a way so yeah anyways guys i am really really hyped i'm a little bit sad because i feel like all of my royal high memories are definitely in this school this was the school that i played first i never played royal high when the old school was out it's kind of weird to think that everything is changing and that i won't be seeing this school anymore but on the bright side it's not a huge deal and i'm very very excited for the new school guys i feel like it's going to be really exciting there's so many things to be excited about with this new school and I'm just ready for the update now, guys, to be honest. I feel like we've all been talking about this update probably longer than we've talked about any other update ever. And everybody is so, so excited about it. So I think it's just time that we got the update. But of course, we need to be patient because the devs are working hard. They're all trying to do their best to get this new update out for us. And I completely understand these things take time. So guys, make sure to stay patient. It hopefully won't be much longer. Lance did say he wants to get the update out today. So fingers crossed it gets out today, guys. And if not, then hopefully it will be out tomorrow. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And if you came here for my recent collab with Cyber, which I had so much fun in, then thank you so much for subscribing and sticking around. I appreciate it. Let me know in the comments if you came from there and you decided to stick around. It does mean a lot. So thank you guys so much. And I will see you guys next time. Bye, everyone. Bye.